Hello Pelican Sound, this is Tim Harris, your head golf professional, here to talk to you about the rules of golf. Uh, today I wanted to specifically talk to you about unplayable lies and your options when you have an unplayable lie. Uh, this isn't really a new rule of golf, but it's something that a lot of people ask me about, what they do when they have an unplayable lie, so I want to make sure everybody is aware of the options that you have. Basically there are three options when you have a ball that you deem to be unplayable outside of a penalty area. So I'm on the right side of river hole number three. I've hit my tee shot a little bit to the right. And you can see this area right here. My ball has landed at the base of this, uh, you know, uh, ornamental grass. Basically, I don't feel like I could get my club on it. So I'm gonna take an unplayable lie. So here are your three options. The first option you have is you can just go back to where you last hit. So I hit my tee shot here. I can go back to the tee and hit again. Problem being, if I do go back to the tee, I'd be hitting you know, putting it on the tee for two and then hitting three. So wherever I hit my next shot, I'd be lying three. A much better option for me to take would be to take the ball and you get two club lengths, no closer to the hole, we either go parallel or to the side or back under penalty of one stroke, okay? Uh, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the ball here and I'm gonna measure two club lengths from where the ball is. So one club length is here Two club links is there. That gets me into the grass at least. Put a mark down there. I can go ahead and I can drop under penalty of one stroke and go ahead and now I'm hitting three from this area. Uh, the third option you have is you can take the flag. The flag is in this direction over here. And you can draw a line from the flag to where the ball came to rest. So it was right about here. Okay draw a line from the flag to where the ball comes to rest and then extend that line back beyond as far as you'd like so I could go back here and drop as well with no restriction on the length of clubs that I have to go back I can go back as far as I want as long as I keep that spot and I can drop here and then I'm also hitting uh, three from that spot so just remember this is only if you have an unplayable uh, lie or a ball outside of a penalty area okay if you're inside a penalty area, then you automatically have to take the ball. Either you can play it from where it lies, you know, but if you're deeming it unplayable, you just come outside from the red stakes or the red lines. This is for unplayable lies that are outside of a penalty area. So those are your three options. Uh, I've attached a video also from the USGA for further explanation, and they have all the neat graphics on there. So maybe you could uh, look at that as well. And if you have any questions, as always, you can contact me. Thanks, everybody.